Hello, if you're seeing this, we are live. YouTube, I thought I'd show you my uh, Banner Lofton CRT running Marvel Superheroes. I just got today through the post. Uh, just share this out if I can. Share to Facebook. Trying to uh, let me just turn it up so you got some assistance while I fiddle on this live stream. If you're there, say hello. How's the uh, my bang on the coming across? Look good. Just going to share it in the group. Maybe somebody's still up on a Friday or not out. Um, I can't use my editing software because my hacked version um, doesn't work anymore. Sorry I'm so disorganised. Um, share this out or tweet this out. If you're live stream, say hello. I thought I'd show that the CRT I've got today uh, for 20 quid with 10, 10 pound delivery is Bang & Lofton MX8000 26 inch TV. I got it today on a retro tip. I was on Facebook Marketplace and um, I saw it the other day. Uh, it was about 10 miles away. I didn't think it would get delivered. Uh, everything was against it getting delivered. I was at work. Um, I couldn't meet the guy. He came early. <laughs> Enough about him coming early. Anyway, yeah, uh, it was 20 quid. 
Facebook Marketplace. On Facebook Marketplace. He said, make me an offer. So I made an offer and uh, 20 quid and 10 quid delivery and it's lovely. I've got some geometry to do on it. I don't know a lot about geometry, but um, I will learn. I can get to the service menu quite easily. So it's uh, not a problem if you want me to... Well, I can't really show you much because it's quite dark in here, but... Um, uh, some size at the back, but not as big as you might think. That's what she said. Anyway, I just got Marvel Superheroes today for the Saturn. Well, I've got it uh, delivered today anyway. Never played this game before. Probably going to be terrible. But it looks really good on this CRT. I'm probably going to take it off the stand actually because it won't fit in my little game room. Even though it's really nice on the stand. Motorized and everything. I don't really know how. I take it sitting on some sort of plate. Probably quite easy to deal with. Who said these are really heavy? I don't think they're that heavy. Getting them up a flight of stairs maybe, but just carrying them normally. I don't think they're that heavy. Literally not what people want to do on this game. Yeah, I've got this uh, for like, I think it's just 14 quid. As you might know, if anybody's been watching any of my videos, I've been buying a lot of Saturn. In fact, that's all I've bought, really, Saturn. Uh, Saturn and some, um, did some pieces to do live streams. I'm gonna get, um, I've got a SCAR adapter coming, so I'll go, and Scott, to give it uh, to HDMI, Paul Smallman and the Retro Tech 100 Facebook group. Um, twig me onto that, and then I'll have to um, get some sort of recording box, HDMI recording box, uh, I forget what they're called now. Somebody will know in the chat. Um, my crap version of Bill Moore, right? I normally used to make videos, I was going to make a video of this. Um, it's not working. And uh, I've used all my slush fun for this month, so I'm going to have to wait till next month to buy a proper copy of Filmora. Because I've tried other software and I just can't use it. It's the only one I'm to use. But with this TV, getting back to this TV, I really like the picture. It's really nice. <coughs> You're seeing flickering there. Obviously, uh, there's no flickering on my end. Flicker free. Anybody is interested, this is the Japanese version of Marvel Super Heroes. It's a lot cheaper. My uh, Sage Saturn's modded, uh, region modded, and 5060 Hertz modded. Say hello if you're in the stream. Hi, Kevin. Yeah, it is amazing. If I see any more, I'm going to pick them up. They take up a lot of space, but imagine having a wall of them. It'd be awesome. Let me know if the live stream's messing up or anything. I'm not having much luck on this end. Uh, I think output and messing up my... Because I, I, I view the stream myself on uh, my laptop. So I can't really tell if everything's fine because it freezes when I upload. Anybody know any special moves? It's a lot to learn on this game. I think when I uh, have completed my Road 100, I'll still collect for Saturn. Then I'm probably going to start Dreamcast, because I was a big Dreamcast fan when I killed it off. And I did have a lot of games because uh, I killed it off, I went and bought everything up. Street Fighter 3, just pretty much out trigger. All the expensive games were going for a quid. I got rid of it, unfortunately, a couple of years later. God, I wish I'd kept it. I really do. It's going to look amazing on this Bang & Olufsen. And the sound on this thing is unbelievable. I've got uh, the proper as well, and it's in excellent condition. I think these can be worth a good bit of money. They're not easy to come in good condition, but listen to the sound on this. Yeah. <laughs> 
down now you can hear me. Oh, not that far down. I'm getting the arse kicked here. I haven't been paying much notice. So in all of the picture, really, and the uh, sound, and you kind of forget that you're supposed to be playing the game. So, interesting to uh, rejig everything in my room. Let's see. I only had time to say hello and goodbye, the Wolverine. I have to get back to making supper, feeding everyone, and doing the dishes. Great CRT. It is a great CRT. Oh, I've been very lucky. Um, Wayne Emerson knows a guy who's also got one. I don't know um, if you can get me the guy's number because I would be interested in picking up another one. Maybe the smaller version. I think the MX4000 is smaller. I wouldn't mind like a, a 20 inch version of this as well. I think the bedroom would be nice. The sound is epic, Kevin. Um, yeah, the old Kate. Yeah, the sound is unbelievable. It's just like the arcade. I've got to get myself an arcade stick now. Alright, we need to change characters because that's getting bored of that now. Ooh. Mm. Oh, I don't want to be Spider Man again. I don't know how you get out of it. And I tested um, Virtual Cop 2 and uh, the gun works, the light gun works perfectly on this. Even j just a 20 quid alone to be able to use my light gun is well worth it. It really looks quite nice in this living room, but uh, the missus won't be like, we're having that here. Maybe it'll go upstairs, but I really like it in the game room, to be honest. Just gonna have to move the ring around again. We'll change characters in a minute. Um, I don't actually know how to get. Any characters when you die, oh, maybe I should just like let myself go. Um, I'm thinking about getting a PC engine of um. Uh, Alan, you know Alan that you see at all the groups, he's got one uh, for, I think he's going to sell one for like 75 quid with the RGB lead, so uh, I think we might go ahead and do that. Uh, or maybe get um, a HDMI to CRT converter for my retro and play retro part on this. That would look great. <coughs> do apologise my coughing, I've got a coughing. Hello to the, I think there's three in the live stream because uh, one of mine, one of it would be my laptop. I really could do with some uh, tips about live streaming. This, this works, you know, but it's very ad hoc. <coughs> I'll play one more round of this and then I'll put on another game I've got today for the Saturn. I was going to put a DVD on and see what it looked like on my PS2, but I'm too lazy to free the cables from my uh, down the cables that I have. I need to go to training mode if this has got one. Oh, I've got an idea how to do it. Oh, 
as you can see, uh, if you look at the side of the uh, left hand side of the bottom, some of the pictures cut off. I just really have to learn how to, uh, to do the geometry because uh, every one of them is different. Plus, uh, I was looking for a video on the MX-8000 on YouTube, I couldn't find one. Found one for the MX-7000, 4000 from um, Rush Newton, which is useful, but all the names of the geometry settings uh, have been changed between... Uh, have been changed between models. So, once that's done, I'll be very pleased with that. Right, what say you that I change the game? Now, without bothering this la bloody screen. Hold on a second, I'll just move you. You can see the lovely scan lines. Beautiful. Right. I am in the right region. Japanese. Now every time it clicks off, you've got to go back to um, you've got to press uh, sat. I've got it on sat connection on the back. Let's get you. Is that okay? Would you like to be closer? I'm um, little little big Dan's game channel. I've just changed the game to a game I won't be able to play at all. Um, that's okay there? Cool. This is layer section. Uh, I think it's a Tete mode game. Uh, because it's like, the second <laughs> off and stuff. But, uh, I'll work that out at some point, I'm sure. Option, let's have a look. Game level normal. Game mode Saturn. TV Yoko pad mode. I don't know. Record? I don't know what that is either. Rapid fire on, game level normal. Should got it easy, push on. I'm not going to do that. Oh, cool. I'll, I'll catch your stream when I've turned this one off. What were you streaming? <laughs> Little Big Dan. <laughs> I don't live stream very much, so it's very ad hoc. Give you me doubles. I know you're supposed to lock on, and uh, I don't know what button it is then to uh, send your rockets. I'm really sure. <coughs> You've got any ideas? The first time I've ever played it. I've got a projector, so this will look very good on the projector. I've got an S-Video cable from a sat now, so I could hook that up. I think I've got an X-Video cable for my um, PS2 as well. As you can see, I've got no... See where it says lock? I don't know how you get the bloody lock on. Oh, lawnmower. Bloody lawnmowers. My lawnmower fella's not come yet. I was too lazy to uh, 
Just do it myself, I'll figure that I'd do. Oh, you know what, it's like elevated music, but if you turn it up, it sounds awesome. Listen! Totally crap at this game. Totally. I know you're supposed to lock on. Oh, I've got to lock. I'm dead again. Oh. Oh. Let me get the Gradius collection. Because that's quite a reason why it is about. 30. Uh, uh, I'm kind of other like, sat games. Well, I've got a long list. More beat em ups, more shooters. Uh, right. I've got an idea. I'll let you pick the next game. I'll take you to what games I've got for the Saturn now. Never mind me yet. Very chintzy living room. That's my, down to my wife. Hold on. Now. What do you fancy? We've got, um, these are all my Saturn games. I've got, uh, Zero Two I was playing earlier, Last Blade. Last, not Last Blade, Last Bronx, sorry. I've got uh, Virtua Fire 2. I've got Virtua Cop 2, Clockwork Nice. Resident Evil and Die Hard Arcade, they're copies. I won't play because I haven't got a locker. It's, mine's modded but not chipped. Just got Street Racer. I haven't played that yet. Um, it's another thing well, I've not really put a lot of time into. I haven't put a lot of time into many of them. But King of Fighters 95. I'm in a cart, a ram cart issue though, so that wouldn't be too easy. Dear Hush Street Fire. Oh, can't see the comments now. Uh, I don't. You can't get Alex Kid for. Um, can't get Alex Kid for the Saturn. Um. Yeah, don't know. Sonic R. It's like a touring car. Go play Daytona. Anybody still watching? Street Rice Racer. Right. Street Racer on. I've not played it on the Saturn yet. Again. Right in my chintzy living room. This is not of my doing, I'm afraid. Let's see how I put the live stream. Look. Live section. Ugh. If I get me arse in the way, I do apologise. I really didn't think much much ahead about this. Yeah, this is a PAL game, so I'm going to have to change the region on the back. Turn it off. Then change the region. I can't read the brother. I think it's all of it for a UK game. On the switch. Oh, oh. Right, where am I at? Have I pressed the go? I haven't pressed go. There we go. Right, sorry about that. We are live, live I tell you. I found you found a PS3 game, have you? I've not really touched my PS3 much lately. Even though it's modded, they can play PS2, from rip discs and PS1. They can all play PS1. I do have to empty my memory, but I'm not going to do it now. I think this will be the last game I play. I don't have any tea yet, and I've got work tomorrow. Lucky me. I do like Ghost Street Racer. Um, it was only... Was it... Six quid on CX? If you're looking for, like, cheaper games now, if you look on the CX website, they're actually undercutting eBay quite a bit. Alright, we'll get over that bit. 
If I drive into something, it's not me, it's cause uh, the camera's in the way. That's the excuse I'm sticking to. Again, I, uh, I'm trying to concentrate. Does look nice when I sat in mine. Yeah, there is no lag on. There's no lag on this CRT. I can guarantee you that. Even though I'm playing badly, that's not the uh, reason. There is absolutely no lag whatsoever. Seconds, not bad. Not bad at all. <coughs> at the end of this stream, I've got uh, a little trick. Well, this TV trick on its sleeve. I'll have to show you. two steering wheels because on CX in a minute the satin steering wheels are only oh, the uh, satin steering wheels are only five over one pound and fifty delivery so you can have two steering wheels you can have two light guns because they're cheap as well uh, I've got two controllers 
I've got to get some arcade sticks as well. Who's saying collecting for the Saturn's expensive? It, 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 unless you're going for uh, like the mega like radiant seal gun and stuff. The best thing you could do if you're going to get a Saturn is either get a Japanese Saturn or get yours modded to play Japanese games if you don't want to go the whole hog and burn the gold disc, you know, copy. Because um, it's a really fun system, very underrated. There's loads of fighters. You like fighters and shooters and racers? Not so much racers, but the ones they do have are pretty good. Got the wrong way, I'm trying to look at the comments. Oh, I'm going the wrong way again, hold on. Abysmal live, live showing of this game. Very controllable though, I'm just making it look difficult. There's nobody around now. Uh, Jack, this telly came from Newton Acliffe, by the way. The guy delivered, to, delivered it to me. He borrowed a van from work and he dropped it off for me. It was really nice. You're gonna get into retro, lad. Get yourself a couple of little CRTs. I bet you've got family that'll just give them to you. Right. <coughs> gonna call it a day there, but I will show you one thing that this TV does. They're about 4550 quid now in uh, CX, so if you get like a regular one, I think maybe less. Uh, if you buy a Japanese one or CX. Uh, Trade some old crap, mate, and uh, get one that way. I think. How did I get mine? Oh, I've got a deal on. Um, I've got a deal on Galaxy Saber for mine. So we'll put genius. Right, we're going to go to snow now for a sec. I'm going to show you a trick that this TV has. Go down the stand options. Go on there. That's right. Oh. I can turn the TV. Turn it that way. Turn that way. When you turn it on, it, it sets it to where you uh, you can store it, what way you want it set in. So say you want it set into like the middle, which I do. You just press go for store, and it stores it the uh, the position you want it on when you turn it on. So because you turn it off, you turn it on, and then it uh, comes on. I oh, sure I might do it now. Actually, no, there we go. Just putting it back itself back to uh, where it was before. It's class, isn't it? But I think I'm going to take the stand off unless I find somewhere to put it because uh, I still want to keep my LCD. Um, so I don't really have enough room to have it on the stand because it would be too high for the shelves that I've got now. So I'm going to have to take the stand off. I think you just bolt it from underneath. I'll have to do it tomorrow after work. So if you've enjoyed this, leave us a like, leave us a comment. You've, le you've all left us loads of comments. Uh, tell your friends, I might be doing another live stream tomorrow. Uh, maybe a PS2 CRT live stream. So this has been Retro Tech 100. I'll see you next time. Hold on a minute. People are asking me questions. What's the weight of the TV? I would say about 50 kilos. Uh, people say it's really heavy, but I guess I don't feel it there. Yeah, you can use the Satin with a, a curved TV. It's gonna the hot if you've got like a 4K one, it's not gonna look great. The the lower the resolution, the better. If you've got a 720p telly, it'll look good. Uh, got any more questions? Leave them in the comments down below. I'm gonna have a bar. This has been Richard Tech 100. I'll see you next time.